Hey, hello everyone. Welcome back to another Caprilux stream. Today, we're playing a weird game. <clears throat> and aren't those always the best? But, uh, from the, the last little game trials that I had, I played a game called Garage Bad Dream Adventure. And I was like, you know what? This game is so fucked up and so weird. I want to continue it. And that's what we're doing today. Uh, let's see if I can remind myself. We basically got Ego and Fuel. Which, I think Ego is kind of like health. Uh, and I don't remember what makes that run out. Fuel runs out over time. Um... We need- we are this little robot guy. And we have to get bait to get frogs to feed them to female robots so that they can give us their milk. Which will be... Ego, I think? Yeah, it's gonna, um... No, it's fuel. Milk is fuel. Okay. Maybe Ego was eating frogs? Yeah, th this is, a. Uh... This game's gonna take a little bit to remind myself what the hell's going on. And, um, I guess the goal of what I need to do. Uh, but let's take a look-see. If I can recall how to open the map... Oh, here it is. So we have all the places labeled I've been to. Um, a whole bunch of stuff over here. I haven't been to a bit, haven't been over here. I kind of just gone around this little square. I've got my room. Here's where I got traps at. Here's where I can fish. Um, I can go between the milky fuel station and the ego clinic to be able to refill on my stuff, which I should probably go to the ego clinic right now. All things considered. And we... Let's just go on this little surreal adventure. Let me make sure I went the right direction. Because you... The perspective can switch around like that. Like, I'm still here. The exact same spot, but now it's switched around. So now I'm staring at the ego clinic. Oh, shit. I don't know if I need to go in. I need to refill my ego, refill my fuel, and I need stamps to do it? Let's see, uh, ego recover- oh, no wait. I forget, what's the carousel versus the ego recovery? Let's see, recover ego level, retype treatment machine, everyone calls it carousel. Using, using music and mechanical vibration. Ego Recovering Machine recovers the Ego Low by using a special liquid called Ego Recovering Liquid. So they both... They both recover it. Uh, maybe one costs more than the other. So let's see, 50 cents for a carousel, 20 cents for Ego Recovering Machine. We'll do Ego Covering Machine. Don't worry about the noises. Okay, we got Ego. Now let's head to get fuel. Because I remember fuel would run out real fast. So I just got to kind of book it. Okay, I apparently went towards the department store. That's what I'm talking about when I got to think about different perspectives in this game. Alright, now we're low on fuel. So Ego does also just run down by itself. Okay, I'm hoping... I think I have to go around the corner. Ah, yes. There was this little... Uh, there's that little keep-out area that I tried going into by timing it, but even that didn't work out. The 10 stamps for fu uh, fuel up. You want to fill up? Yep. Go back and choose a female machine you like. Okay, so this is the weird... The weird part of this game of... The female machines got tits. I'm not, you know, I'm not going to put it lightly. They got tits, and they they give me milk for fuel. Uh, so, you know, let's just go up here. This is, um, 
Michio. Yep, and we just shove our robot cock or whatever in there. Or something. So now we're fueled. We got Ego, we got fuel. Um, and there are... Where is it? There's achievements, which if I do these achievements, then I can get items. Which is pretty nice. I, I like that. I appreciate being able to get... Um, things out of my achievements. Sorry, I'm just opening Pepsi. Um, so... If we get to the Milky, Milky Fuel Station's back door, we'd get 500 more stamps. That sounds not so bad. I'm guessing that's here. Let's just see if I can get over there. You know? Just a little journey. Never mind. That also has the... So these red points are, I guess, like the stops. But yeah, that also has the things that'll slam down on me. Um, tell you what then, let's, let's go fishing. Hey bud, um... No, I remember how to fish, I think. Let's see, so I can use the hook. I can use Mighty Claws. I think I can use any of these as bait, but Mighty Claws is fine. And I think I have to move this in accordance to however this arrow is moving. And I want to keep it in the middle. I don't remember how much fuel or ego or whatever this uses while I'm doing this, but, you know. Oh, or maybe I pump it. Okay. Yeah, let's try, say, try to get something good. Got many frogs. It's, um... Yeah, so we're... We, we catch frogs to, like, I'm pretty sure feed the female machines. Like, listen, I'm not... I, I'm just trying to make sense of it. Maybe it doesn't make sense, but whatever. Oh, I missed it. Maybe I was supposed to not mess with this ahead of time. Okay, no, there we go. I'm, I'm getting used to it. Okay, so I have to start that. And then make sure it doesn't go in the red. I want to catch something other than the Godot. Come on, something new. Alright, one more. Ooh, but I got, got a fish hook back. Yeah, I, I'm gonna be honest, I think, I think I enjoy these very surreal games just because I love figuring shit out. I love a game where I'm starting out and I'm confused as all hell. Okay, let's see what's in the toy works. But trying to learn how everything works is a fun experience. Oh, he finished the music box, that's right, I brought that to him at some point. Let's see, it sounds wonderful. We'll give you a score, too. See the music box and Bocanero's score. Psyche, I've heard that name, but who was it? Oh, I think I'm looking for Psyche. He used to run a toy factory. Of course, they made a variety of toys, but nobody wants a toy today. Toys used to have a function as a learning device, but nobody is interested in studying anymore. In this world, the act of studying can only have limited value. All values are absorbed into a female machine's stomach. Let's see, I have the letter from Shin. Let's see, talk about the ego clinic. Oh yeah, that's right. When I have low ego, I also can't talk. I I forget what they call it. Um but they call it like word loss or something. So I can't talk to people when I have low ego. 
That's just a whole nother thing. Okay, so I got the music box. Okay, uh, very good song you've given me, I suppose. Um, got these memos. That was for the music box. Are we not allowed to open the floodgate? Don't remember what that was about. Remember to ask Lau where he is. I can't find my shout, everything will be over. Off to living with pass forever. So I guess I'm. Let's see, find your shadow. Everything will start from there. Get out of some decent world. This world is not right. Yeah. And I think I had like maybe a teeny little quest that was on. I am supposed to find Psyche, but I don't remember at this point. So let's go, let's see what's in, I'm guessing that's the Hukuju apartment. <laughs> Man, I wish I could read. Some of these signs are in English, others are not. Robot milk, that's correct. You missed me um, sticking my apparatus into the female machine to give her the frogs to get the milk. Can I go anywhere here? Okay, I guess not. A very fun, abstract... Ah, here's one of the female machines. You know Psyche, hmm? Psyche is a shadow. Shadows is something like an alter ego. Is the alter ego which everyone should have had. You might still have one. Yeah, I bet you do, but shadows eventually evaporate. They vanish, so you should hurry. If it happens, everything will be over. You will never be able to go back. Huh? Go back where? Anywhere. Excellent. <laughs> I don't know enough about Persona 4 to say, but yes. Okay, I don't have a bottle trap. Uh, where do I have- wait. Is this where I want my trap set, or is this just showing me that's where a trap can be set? Okay, I'm guessing that's just where a trap can be set. Well... Okay, I- There's not a track leading here, but I wonder if I can go around this way. Could sell my crabs and frogs. Here, you can exchange crabs and frogs for milky fuel station stamps. I'll take anything. If you don't have stamps, you won't be able to shop. Refill yourself or recover your ego level. You should set bottle traps and fish frogs as much as possible. By the way, did you bring anything today? Uh, here's like... Three Godots. And... Probably shouldn't sell the Mighty Claws, because isn't that bait? Well, though they're hard to come by, if you catch a rare frog, well, I'll take it for a high price. Rare frogs may not fill female stomachs, but there are demands for them. What do you want to exchange? Do I only sell? Do I not buy anything from you? Alright, well, never mind then. Hey, where's this lead? Oh, this is another bottle trap. Should probably check on my traps. Alright. So, Ego Clinic, there's the three... There's the three ego-filling station things. I remember, I think I went back here once, but let's, let's go back in there. Let's see what's what. Okay. As far as we're going there. Okay. Oh yeah, I think these are like pleasure chambers or something. Because this guy like freaks out. There's two me, the me asleep and the me awake. 
Okay, or not. I don't know. I don't know what that's about. I'm not getting anything out of it. Pretty sure he's. See, be careful about your ego level. It's a good thing that you weren't stiff yet. Stiff, I think, is a state that has to do with your ego being super low. Alright, we won't worry about feeling ego yet. We're we're pretty good. Yeah, so it just doesn't let me go that way. Well, um, let's go. Go to the right, or find somewhere else to fish. Need them frogs, after all. So let's go... I don't know why I keep saying yes to that. Let's go that way. Go this way. On the bogey factory. What do you want? As you can see, I'm making a bogey. You can have one attached to- or you have one attached to you, don't you? Yes, that bogey. There's a problem. The lathe chuck is broken. I can't clamp the wheels to the lathe. wonder if there's a new chuck somewhere. Young man, if you find a usable chuck somewhere, could you bring it to me? Hmm. I think I can upgrade my robot to where he has more fuel and more ego. Ah uh, yeah, here's, here's the explanation. You feed crabs you caught to female machines or use them as baits to catch frogs and give the frogs to female machines. By doing so, mil milky fuel, which is our fuel, will be made inside the stomach of female machines. So I need crabs as bait to catch frogs to give to female machines. Or I guess I can give crabs also to female machines. Let's see. Everyone's relying on milky fuel station stamps or anything. I don't like those stamps. Well, buddy. You do you, I suppose. Hey. I like mysterious things. For example, the carousel. Why is it called carousel, although no one knows why exactly a carousel is? That is weird. The thing is called by a name something no one has ever seen or heard of. I'm guessing it's something that doesn't exist here, but exists somewhere. Oh yeah, if you find anything mysterious, tell me about it. Just its name will do. Do I know anything? Uh, it used to be different. All male machines used to fish. You catch frogs by fishing, you know. And be sure you'll be able to fish where there is a wide sewage water surface. There are only a few machines that fish nowadays. My husband talks big, but he's not so different from others. I'm... This your husband? You're a filthy stamp user, aren't you? Alright, well, we're... There's gotta be more... Fishing pla- Well, I guess there's that place. Oh, so that looks like a fishing area. Tell you what, let's fill up on fuel. And then I will... Is I think I need to go right? And then once I'm filled up on fuel, I'll go fish somewhere. <laughs> That's not where I want to be. Uh, go onto this track. And then head left. The Milky Fuel Station. Very, very confusing, but I can... Uh, I can kind of get through the confusion. Alright, we'll use um, this female machine this time, I guess. Dan, hello. Thank you for coming. It's... Okay, so where are we going? I head to the outer tracks, so I need to head this way, then head left. Evil. 
Who are you? Oh no! He doesn't have ego, he's got word loss or whatever. Well, shame, because I guess I can't do anything for you. A oh, note. Shit, <laughs> I clicked through too quick, too fast. Um, I'm free, I'm free, I can do anything. Okay. Uh, useful, I guess. What's something just like kills me? What if it's one of those games where something just jumps out and kills me? All right, let's go fishing. Um, we we'll use a regular fish hook. We'll throw it. You know what? We're gonna throw in a root mimic. See how that does. See what kind of frogs we catch. Ooh, rusty frog. Okay. Does the bait give the exact same frogs? Don't have enough power to fish it. Well, come on. Alright, I guess I want to get stamps so that I can have enough power to get better frogs. Teal head Godot. Well, that kind of pisses me off. Anytime there's a game where I don't have an upgrade or whatever for something, then I'm going to fully focus in just getting that upgrade. The problem is, is I don't think I can just full blast go for a certain part because I think some parts have compatibility or whatever. Oh yeah, also there's this time thing, which I guess... I guess I've been here for like 36 cycles or whatever. I don't know what this means at all. I don't... Maybe it's like a score thing? In which case I don't care? But... Yeah. Anyways, I think in the Maria department store there's someone that sells parts, so... Uh, forget this place. If I need to get some more stamps, then I'll do whatever I need to do for that. In fact, do I have to, do I have to click through to get these stamps, or do I just automatically get them? Oh, perfect. Unless I did had a fight. Oh, shit. Special accessory to a female machine. Gave a female machine her favorite frog. You've crabs and frogs many times. Huh. Okay. So. Anyways. Let's uh, get to the Maria department store. Chigo Clinic's that way. I want to go that way. Maybe next time I need Ego, I'll, I'll go to the carousel. I think I can make it. I don't think I have to worry about Ego right now, currently. Are you just the frog guy? Yeah. What? Teal head? Oh wait, that's how many I have, okay. Whoa, 300 stamps, what the hell? Oh my god, Teal head's good! And the pat patinated rusty frog. Ooh, okay, keep. Uh, let's wait on that. I don't super need the money right now, so we'll not worry about it. This is the second fuel station. Not quite where we want to be. For second floor, I think that's where the department is. Department store. See, it's just the the fun part about 
looking around, exploring, seeing what's in the environment. Alright, what do you want? As you can see, this is a used park shop. Well, we need... Making your carburetor's diameter larger, you'll be able to produce more power. You'll need it when you have your body modified at Morawaki Customs. Okay. Sounds good, I guess. Strengthens the crank so that it can endure high output. If you don't install this, the motor will break when you increase engine power. So it sounds like I need this to increase my engine power. Okay, need this to adjust the carburetor. Force of valve spring set. Uh, part that allows you to withstand high engine speed. If you want to fish large frogs, you should get installed. You need it once you have your body modified at Morawaki Customs. Expands the motorsport. It makes the piston larger. Us collecting. You improve your engine power by improving exhaust efficiency. You'll need it when you have your body modified. When am I going to have my body modified? Be able to move around more, get installed on the third floor. So I could get this first reserve tank. Which is nice for fuel, I suppose. What if I... Just save up. Okay, let me look at this. So I need that for power. Oil cooler. I'll cools the motor oil by increasing the surface area of oil flow. I will break down if the motor becomes too hot. So I don't want the motor to become too hot. Yes. These all sound like things that need to be done, like, kind of all at once. You know what, maybe, um... Road the boat. Maybe the first hour or so we'll just do some regular fishing. Two apartments lift. Five... Every items get five frogs to Suru. What Anu sound about mysterious things? Anyway, you know what? For just to see how this works, let's get this reserve tank, which you get installed at Morawaki Customs on the third floor. Okay, it's good. Over here, come to my shop. I have everything you need. Female machines use this when eating crabs. So if I want to feed them female machine crabs, I need to get a stand, I guess. It cools your room. It brightens your room. I don't know what those do for me. Hello. Toby, what you got for me? Frog oil, crab butter, ooh, reco eco recovery liquid. This might actually be good to have on hand. Just in case they start dying. You want. Chuck number zero. Number 100. Uh, let me grab a couple of ground bait. I think I. One. No fishing information. Uh, to fish frogs, you should first get information. It lists the baits, fish hooks, and ground bait suit for each frog. You might think it's a little expensive, but you won't regret it. I could probably learn myself. I don't know if I need to buy information about it. Giant stubby frog. Okay. Well, let's um, get this tank installed, I guess. <clears throat> like I said, 
I assume more Milwaukee Customs is here. I need to remember to look for notes and things. Here we go. Hey, you. Can you install my stuff? Stage one, tuning. Energy and power on your level will be improved by fine tuning each part to maintain bodily functions. Consequently, you'll be able to fish frogs that tug strongly. Because the neural communication becomes smoother, because circulatory systems, energy loss is reduced. No additional parts necessary. Installing a reserve tank. Oh, that costs a hundred. If you find a larger one, come to me, I have a chain. Oh, well, first let's see if there's any... Okay, you get ground bait. The achievements that I've unlocked. Okay, so it looks like it's a no. I'll need more stamps if I want to do that. Right. Well. Guess a grind for money then. Secret passage. Oh, that's right. I remember coming across this. But no clue what the combination should be. <laughs> so take a look at my beautiful face, I guess. Alright. Time for some good old fishing. As soon as I get an ego and a fuel refuel. But oh, what's over this way? So. I guess I can hit a um, fuel station. That you go store each way. Assuming I don't go past it. Alright, time to fill up. Did I use this machine yet? Reiko. Hi, Reiko. Go, please. Should give me more stamps. Now I just get to the ego clinic. Which I'm actually almost dangerously low on. Alright, you know what? Oh, wait, I want enough stamps for the carousel. Damn. It's gonna go in, but. Well, actually. Alright, it's carousel time, baby. It's more expensive, but let's see what I get from it. First side of the track you came, there's a machine level rotary rotary type treatment machine again on it. <laughs> okay, it's actually a carousel. I don't know what I expected. Time for some low-level fishing. Plenty of hooks. Plenty of crabs. <laughs> I expected you're telling me. I thought it was good. I, I honestly thought it was just another female machine or something. Ooh, nice. That's the bait. I um I watched part of what was it um Tyler Perry's Acrimony last night. Uh, it was a pretty interesting movie. Um, basically just this sort of self-destructive story of this lady 
having a relatively terrible life and kind of putting all the blame on everyone except her. Sorry, why am I not catching this? Um, which I, I gotta say, love stories like that. I, <laughs> I love stories with a self-destructive protagonist where they just kind of keep doing it to themselves. Oh. Okay. Oh, I see. So it doesn't have to stay just in the middle. It has to go up high. Um, and apparently had really bad reviews. Because at first I was worried. I was like, you know, it was recommended. And then it had some pretty not great reviews. But I'm wondering if it's just because people didn't like... You know, either they didn't like the message, or maybe they don't like uh, protagonists being kind of assholes. Um, which, granted, you know, part of the story with how it played out, it, it wasn't fully her fault at first. She, you know, married this guy, and he just seemed to be driving them the hole for money. But then he actually started doing very well. But, you know, she didn't really, like, believe in him or, like, thought he cheated or whatever. These fish are going fast. There. Um, and so she was just like, nah, I'm, I don't believe you now. And he's like, okay, well, here's, like, millions of dollars for my invention or whatever. Like, have a good life. And she's like, oh shit. She's like, no, you owe me more money due to all the stuff you put me through. He's, and the judge in the court was just basically like, he already gave you millions of dollars. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I sort of realized that. Hey, you know, far be it for me to gatekeep um, media consumption. Two-headed Godot, hell yeah. But, I feel like, you know, I, I feel like people also need to realize that, like, you know, even if a protagonist is bad in a story, that can be kind of the point of it. Of, like, sometimes, you know, they're only the protagonist because we're following their story. Um... But I don't know. You know, kind of, kind of to each their own. Man, you want to know something embarrassing? I still haven't watched a single episode of Breaking Bad or Better Call Saul, even though I know it's kind of different. But I, I want to watch through Better Call Saul, then watch through Breaking Bad, and I just have not <laughs> pushed myself to do it. We're gonna get so much money from these frogs. Yeah, I, I hear that a lot with uh, Breaking Bad as well. Although at this point, I feel like Breaking Bad has just become such a meme that, again, that's everyone's like, that's everyone's massive exposure to is just the memes of it. grabbed it too early. I'm gonna try changing the bait, see if that'll get me a different frog. Um, but yeah, I think it's very interesting how people won't, uh, won't really put much into watching or it just, I guess just experiencing things. Never mind, I don't have enough power to fish it. Fuck it, going back to my claws. Uh, it happens a lot, a lot with books, it seems, of when people want to read about, like, stories where kind of nothing's wrong with the protagonist. Ooh, this will cost a lot of money. Um, and it's like, I get it, you know, real life do be sucking and a lot of shitty people. But again, man, I <laughs> love the self-destructiveness of a, 
of a fictional character. Ooh, albino Godot. What else? A, a kind of example of that. Um, also this past weekend I watched um, Bottoms. And <laughs> basically what that is, is... Alright, you'll have to stick with me here. It's a little weird, but... It's supposed to be a high school fight club that these two girls started as technically labeled as a self-defense club, but just so they could bang the cheerleaders in their school. <laughs> and so it was... It was just a really goofy story. Um, and you know, I... If, if I, like, were to go into detail, it's not, like, the best story, but it's just a fun, silly, goofy, like, okay, they do this, um, you know, they have some random-ass plot where they fight the opposite team's high school, or opposite team's football team and kill them, and it was just like, that makes no fucking sense. But, you know, like, what a silly, goofy time. <sighs> yeah, I, I I guess a lot of people do want to turn off their brains for things. I don't know how I'm missing these things when it doesn't give me the chance to get it. <laughs> um, which, yeah, I, <laughs> I also remember... I saw this thing recently where it was, um, a screenshot of some TikTok where someone in the comments was like, was like, bro, you don't have to think about movies so hard. It's not, you know, it's not literature or something. And the person was just like, I can't believe what I'm reading. I, I would say it's an easy watch. It's like an hour and a half. You could probably just like throw it on. Teal head, nice. Um, there's <laughs> there's some good jokes in it. Like, honestly, a lot of what I liked in that movie was the background shit. Uh, there's just a lunch scene, and I don't even remember what was happening in the lunch scene because I was too focused in the background. There's a guy like deep throating a hot dog or pretending to, or a corn dog, and I'm like, what the fuck is happening back there? I'm like, what's going on? And it's. You know, those are the, that's the fun kind of details. Um, I assume people want all the time in their kind of media. Not deep throating corn dogs per se, but just to have something goofy on. And you know, I'll say, I don't exactly have the highest standards either. You know, I'm not exactly like, huh, well, I gotta, I gotta be, you know, thinking critically in all my movies or whatever. But if a movie's plot takes me out of it, if I think about it for a second, then a lot of times, like, sorry, you've lost me if you take yourself seriously. I think that's why with Bottoms, it's like kind of whatever, because at least it's a comedy. It's not trying to do anything grandiose, I suppose. Nice. I guess the only point in this game right now, I suppose, to get myself stamped so I can get these parts. Which I might actually be able to get if I just keep getting these really good, um, really good frogs. Meanwhile, poor, um, what's your name? Takashi is just sitting here. I guess I, let's, let's try using the Godot, see what I get. Although the frogs might, uh, yeah, I don't have enough power. Never mind on that. Just keep going with the same shit. Nice. 
All right, one more um, really good Godot, and then we'll move on. Yeah, I, th I think if anything, mostly what I look out for in a story or whatever is, <laughs> and I I know how the big head this sounds, but just just a plot that makes me feel something, you know. I wanna I wanna be able to watch something and be so enraptured by the story. And I'm just like I can't look away from this. Uh, something good. Two headed. Uh, that might be good. Oh wow, and you don't lose like any ego and fuel when fishing. Okay. Well, that's pretty great. Um, let's see. I have. Okay, can I just set the bait? Oh, I need a bottle too. Just the carousel. Um, let me think. I don't remember what Hajime does. Let's go peek her head around the corner and find out. Hey, Hajime. Let's see, Psyche? Yeah, I know her. She's strange. She's not a jumble like us. She's more soft and smooth, like smoke. There used to be guys like her, but I haven't seen one lately. Psyche is good friends with Yang. Yang is the owner of the Milky Fuel Station. Lee at the Milky Fuel Station number two might know more about her. After all, he's the owner of Station number two. Right. Seems as a, uh... Shit. That ball trap might have actually had something. There we go. Okay, pull up the ball trap. Oh, look at all that. And pot crab? Hell yeah. Alright, here's some, uh, silver ground bait. Should probably go to... Where's... I don't remember where, um, crab selling guy is, so... Here's field station number two. I don't really want to heal up, but do you know about Psyche or whatever? Hmm. Maybe if I go this way. Hey. Oh, it's you again. What do you want? What? Psyche? You want to meet Psyche? Hmm. Hey, you may already know, but Milky Fuel is created in the stomach of female machines. They ferment crabs and stomach crabs and frogs inside their stomach, but since the sewers decrease, we're short of crabs and frogs. Frogs would probably be difficult, so bring me fifty crabs. I can catch them with bottle traps. My claws would be fine. We can talk after that. Fuck. Any do I have? Uh oh. No. Thirty-three. I guess I need 50. Alright, well. Like, busting my balls for this. Let's see, you can't come here directly. Please go to reception first. Right. Um, hmm. Go this way. It's just the elevator. <sighs> okay. I wanna get here. What? How do I? If I go around. That puts me right there. If I go this way, I just bring me back. It's, well, I mean, I guess it doesn't really show the tracks connecting. Whatever. Um, didn't I get some achievements? Let's see. Chin. 
cool. I guess I just need to sell my crabs. Oh, there we go. Getting a lot of good hooks. Oh wait, yes, this is one I placed. Oh, six. Okay, it's not the worst, I guess. There. So, 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 maybe the... Sweet. I, I need to remember where these people are. So your crabs, yes. Exactly what I want. Perfect. Hey. I got a... See, I'm gonna assume I don't need these, like... I mean, they're not too hard to get. I just need to sit and fish for a bit. So, how about... Two of these? Oh my god, these two had Godot go for a thousand stamps? Holy shit. Okay, one. Oh my god, these two head ones are really, really good. Uh, we'll sell, like... I don't know. Uh, 24, sure. Yeah, we'll wait on the rest of frogs. I, I think I'm just... I'm hesitant because I don't want it to turn out like, Oh, you need to feed... You know, you need to feed the machines this frog. Or, like, you need to bring this for whatever reason. Right? Besides, I have 1,500 now. Although, if I want the better parts... I'll just have to... I'll just have to do a bit of fishing. Not like there's a whole lot else to do. Actually, I don't think I've... Oh, that's right. It's because I'm being blocked here. I can't go past this point yet. Um, where else have I not been? Uh, there's the Fukuju Apartments. I don't think these tracks connect, but we'll check it out. Yeah, why not? Wrong way. I'll be real, I don't know. This is supposed to be a surreal Japanese game from like 1999 or something. I believe... So in the beginning, I think I was like a person that sat in a machine that I'm assuming this is like a dream world or something and it brought me here. So I don't know if the point is like to appreciate life or something extravagant. But I, you know, there's just this world and I'm just living in it. Okay, so there is something that I guess will connect with this. Can't do it now. For now, I'm just, um, seeing it, oh. This lay doesn't have anything to say to me. For now, it's kind of just surviving. I'm doing pretty good now. Before, like, I think you could soft lock yourself if you run out of stamps and keep running out of fuel and ego. But uh, I'm not doing too bad now. Okay, let's go back into the department store and we'll get those... Well, at least get the tank put in. And like, who knows how long this game will last, right? Like, it could be... It could be like a... 20 hour long game, or it could take, I don't know, like, six. And I, so it's, oh, I meant to read the description, but that's okay. 
The Sage of Eyes been modified to Sage 1. Engine power increased. Your ego level increased 10%. Okay, not bad. Oh, you need these parts to get... Okay, okay. So you need these parts to get these upgrades. You need a large diameter, carburetor, and exhaust collecting pipe. You'll need both. All right. I see. So we just want to keep getting, I think, upgrades for everything. Um, let's see what some of the large... If any achievements, give me a large amount of stamps. Let's see, visit the lighthouse. This is the factory warehouse. I'm sure I'll just get that over time. Um, got their stage two parts. Got their stage three parts. Oh, what I have to do? Bogey. Acquired all notes. But all products at your show GB shop. This is all just fishing. If I refuel with um same female robot multiple times, I think that'll get me a lot of stamps. Alright, well. Here we go. On my on my bad garage whatever journey. So I said collecting posters. Can I collect these? Oh, that's right. Secret passage. Hey, like rip this down from the wall. Oh, keep an eye out for a I guess five digit something or other. I haven't been back to my room in a while. That, that maybe looked like a, um... There's the second floor here, maybe? Maybe I just need to look at the second floor for a lot of this stuff. Like here, it looks like there's a track that actually leads to this spot. So like, around here. I don't know. Look into it. Let's um, let's get some milky fuel, huh? So we need to go this way. Where did I pass it? Oh, wrong way. way yeah there we go okay uh 13 stamps are fuel up because oh, it's so much i guess all right hey liz how goes it thanks for that each time i go to a fuel station it's, it's like don't it's like don't don't want to acknowledge it with a bottle. So I guess the bottle traps I can just set and forget about it, which is kind of nice. I I don't think they can fill up. All right. Well, now that I feel, let's head to my room. See if there's any elevator or something I can use to get around. Here's where I thought the elevator was, or maybe it's up there. Well, at least save. Which I have no clue what this is. Open. Open. 
Oh god, no. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, that's... That's not happening naturally. Alright, um, forget that. Let's keep a record. Oh, here we go. Hold on. Um... Huh. Yeah, that doesn't lead where I was hoping it would. I'm guessing this is what used to be the track that way. <laughs> Alright, never mind on that. Um, I guess we're going fishing. And just gonna talk about wherever the hell again. We'll, uh, we'll fish, fish out here. Fish out in the outer tracks. Alright, actually. Bottle here? No. I need to buy some bottles. I, I just need to buy some. Honestly. Let's go in the bogey factory real quick. He said something about, uh, he's making a bogey. Oh, he needs a new, he needs a lathe chuck, okay. I don't know where to find that. Alright, let's go get a bunch of, um, two head godots or something. Is it this way? Can I not give you any ego or anything? That guy's just done. I say, hey, isn't that a rusty frog yet with you? How nice to be able to fish. If it's possible, would you give one to me? Sure. You're so sweet. You can have this if you like. Oh, nice. You can only catch crabs with ball traps, you know. Crabs may fill my stomach, but not my heart. Alright, well, uh, cool. Progress. Where? Okay. It's like, where am I going? The good news is fishing really doesn't affect ego or fuel at all. Eh, we'll keep using fish hook number one for now. Now let's use root mimics. I was gonna say, unless a lot of them are, um, take too much power. I, I do kind of like the mechanics of this fishing game. What the fuck? What the fuck kind of grab was that? Or is that the... I guess that was the crab and not the fish? Um... I like whenever a game does have very fun sort of mini game mechanics. You know, I, I know Skyrim slash Fallout kind of set the standard for, or wait, yeah, Skyrim and Fallout have the standard for like lock picking mini games. But I wish um I wish games would come up with a new lock picking mechanic. You know, I I feel like now whenever I see a game. That uses the same old lock picking mechanic. I get a little bored with it. I'm just like, oh, I, you know, <laughs> just gotta force this. I think this fishing is so easy because you don't. Also, unlike most games, you don't use up the bait and hook on every single fish. Oh, mock root. It's not root mimic. Weird little creature. <sighs> what is that game I played that is also very weird looking? That's the one made by Ice Pick Lodge. Um, well what whatever that game is, like I I love this is one reason why it seems like a lot of times old games are really good for this kind of aesthetic. 
And you know, I'm not I'm not saying that these games don't come out nowadays. But I feel like if you want to find a really weird, really strange looking game, you just gotta go looking around things that were made around the 90s. And you can find some sort of like indie title that like no one's ever heard of. And just gives you this really strange aesthetic. And like I say, I love it. I, I think it's just because it's... It's a weird subconscious like thing in your brain of like, ah, oh, this is new, you know, so I haven't seen this before. Like, sure, I could play, um, you know, the, like, whatever the latest, uh, big titty anime game is, but man, what other game can I play where I fish for frogs using crabs as bait and then give it to a female machine to get milk out of her for my fuel, right? Where else can I say that? That would make any sort of sense. <laughs> I, and um, same for that other Ice Pick Lodge game where it was like, oh, I have to get colors by killing these creatures to feed to the, um, you know, to feed to the lazies or wherever they were. I forget the terminology now. <laughs> I won't lie. I'll probably forget about all the terminology in this game like, a few weeks after playing it. But in the moment, it's fun to describe how weird and fucked up it is. Oh yeah, I should probably... I need to go around and um, get all the bait traps. So I can get enough mighty... Mighty claws to give to... Uh... What's his face at Milky Station number two? There it. Let, let's. Yeah, just one more two head. Um, whatever they're called, Godot. And then I think I'll be happy. Cause again, that's what a thousand stamps. I mean, set. At least for fuel and ego. Yeah, not. <laughs> and even with not too much going on as far as like the animation here. Oh, perfect. There we go. All right, one more. Um, but it's. I, I think I just think it's cool to be like, oh, look at this little like weird looking penis looking. Uh, uh was it frog thing? Alright. So now we got Ingado, four albinos, three teal heads, two two headed. So it can provide me a lot of stamps if I need to. Uh get them. Let's see if I can talk to her again. If you are a male machine, you should fish. You males bring crabs and frogs, and we eat and change them into mu milky fuel. You should think about yourself first, you know? Want well, to please a female, you should become a good fisherman. Or things to fish, frogs are delicious, you know? Frogs are more delicious than crabs. Crab's meat is dry and its shell is hard, but it'll make your jaw strong. Really, the fishing spot behind our house is a great spot to catch rare frogs. I wonder what you can catch there. Okay, just gotta make sure I exhaust dialogue. Okay, yeah, he's done for, I guess. Right, well, can I set a bottle trap here? Oh, perfect. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and do that. Alright. So, two... Let's go here, go left, 
check this bottle trap. Caught many crabs. Nice. Okay, I think we can go to what's his face now. We can get information about Psyche. I hope. Oh, just barely 50. I want to get a bit more Mighty Claws so that. Well. I can always get more from Ball Trap, so whatever. We can just go there. So I'll hit the Ego Clinic and then head to the Milky Fuel Station. At least with it being a relatively small map, I am not getting lost as much. But, um, you know what, let me, oh, well the carousel was just, it was literally the carousel, wasn't it? And just get me into the ego recovering machine. It's faster refuel too. I don't super know what uh I don't super know what the point is to use the carousel. Even though he probably says um description Carousel machine used to recover ego level yeah, literally just used to recover ego. Hey, here's the word lost. Let's see. Ego becomes low. You first become unable to speak. That's called word lost. Um, following word loss comes stiff. You become stiff. You lose control. Your arms won't be able to do detailed work. Cover yourself right away. Okay, so you can't even save basically. What the hell did he say? Okay, then, you'll just die. Fuck you, buddy, I just used your ego recovery machine. Okay. Um. Anyways. I don't have a ball trap. Alright. Come on. Fill me up, Liz. Thank you, Liz. Alright. So, you got them? Are you gonna give them to me? Sure. Listen, Psyche is at the lighthouse in a restricted area, but to enter the lighthouse, you must go through the laboratory. The laboratory is next to the factory, but to enter the laboratory... I don't know what I'm saying like that. Laboratory, you need to unlock the door to lock the special lock. It's impossible. Do you get it? Well then, go away now. Hey, chapter two, cool. I tell you everything I know. I don't know what you want to know, but why do you want to know about it so much? You're weird. Wasn't well, it so? You don't seem like you're a machine of this world. Well, cool. I just kind of dumped those for no reason. So I need to get through the laboratory. Looks like the lighthouse here. Maybe here, I don't know. <sighs> Alright, well. Guess I can sell crabs to get parts and whatnot. Okay, cool. Got my mighty crabs back. Let's head to, um,. Oh yeah, wasn't there something I had to fix here? Like fix the elevator or something? I literally keep forgetting every time I come here. Yang is the one who started all this. Everyone was swayed by Yang, but Yang had no such intention. Aren't, aren't I Yang? He doesn't care about others, he just did what he wanted to do. What a nuisance. By the way, there's something I wanted to ask you. Do you know Yang? So you do. I thought so. I don't know about you, but I think that laboratory is worth nothing. I'm an old machine, do you know what that means? Old means keep your nose out of other people's business, but pride doesn't matter to you. See, we can only do one thing at a time. If you think I'm lying, try it yourself. What if I said I don't see? 
Wait, what does this say? Oh. Now I could check this. Okay. Huh. That's actually pretty useful. Uh, well, I accidentally just messed something up, so I've got to... Alright, let me head into the Toy Works first. Let's not go that way. I wasn't head that way. Um, let me check the Toy Works real quick. Then I'm gonna go to... Back to my room to save, because... I had to plug in my headset and, and now I can't hear anything. Oh, he has an extra chuck. Hell yeah. I don't really like the laboratory. Every toy used to come with a simple song. Sound... Sounds add life to the toys. Sound has magical powers. While making toys with music, I was fascinated by the device that produced the sound itself. And so I made the music box. Lyle came up with the idea of Carousel when he saw the music box I made. Oh, why don't you create a score yourself? Since you own a music box, you should have your own score. I just happen to have a piece of score paper right here. There's nothing difficult to it. You just have to punch holes in the paper according to the melody that comes to mind. Here, use a sponge to make holes. Come on, try it. What's the first note? Then punch here. Next here. Yes, that's it. You're doing great. Wonderful, you did it. Let's try playing it. Boy, as I uh, mentioned previously, I accidentally cut off my volume so I can't hear it. I hope it's a... I was gonna say, I hope it's a nice melody. Alright, cool. Alright, no more... Wait, 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 whoa, 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 why is Takashi not there? I was gonna say no more dilly dallying, but now Takashi's gone. I obey myself, I act as I order, I have my own will. Side, so I just gotta go all the way around. Oh, I can take the posters from here, I guess. Got two head machine, blue letters. Got the amazing world, machine, such red. Got eco destroying show, second half green. Got crab butter, red label. Oh, I can just take all the shit here. Happy hour, it was torn. Got frog oil. Happy Hour Orange. Interesting. Got the Amazing World, Reiko slash Red. Bunch of crab butter, frog oil. It's torn. Very yellow. Or blue. Okay, so I guess I need to pop around here more often. See what we got. Nice. I'll assume there's no inventory limit, so I don't have to worry about that. All right, let me save and <clears throat> reset this real quick. Hold on, let me just double check. Can I continue? No. Yeah, that's what I figured. All right, hold on. Uno momento. Just a simple relaunch. Should be fixed right up, I hope. Okay, I'm not hearing anything. All right, hold on a second. Okay, fix it. Turns out it just shut off on me for some reason. 
So... Seems like everyone has different dialogue, so that's Dr. Hajime. Laboratory, this should shut down a place like that. You too, you shouldn't play around with your body. But if you're playing fish, that, then it's a different story. But I still don't understand what's so fun about making weird drugs and equipment. Your machines like Noom doesn't seem to think much about it, but I don't like it. Hey, do you know Noom? No. Noom is a machine who used to work at Mia's workshop, and now that Mia can't speak, I wonder what he's doing. You'll find him if you go to the outer track from there and go straight. This guy named a uh, couple, I believe he worked at a laboratory. I do know. Oh, you do, huh? Okay, let me listen to my score. Very good. It's probably like, oh my god, there's so much. It's getting more and more stuff. Oh, I don't have any bait. Okay. That's fine. Now I'll need bait. Um. Yes, yeah, so we can go back into Mia's. Oh, uh, what was that? All the way to the back? Oh, there's Noom. Uh, the factory workers might know something about the laboratory next door, but they are all clunkers. Especially Tasan. He forgets everything except his job. You should know about it since he works right by it, but the only things he says is, heh. <laughs> Some of you might trigger his memory, but from the look of him, I think there's a little chance. An old machine might know more about Tasan. Let me see. Maybe the machine's at the Fukuchu. Who could you apartment knows? Hmm. Okay. It's me. Um. Give you a frog. You know the press machines, the ones at the entrance to the restricted area. Mia made them. Mia made the new world, the lighthouse, everything. He doesn't make things anymore. There's nothing to make. He doesn't talk anymore. The only thing he does is stir my stomach. Oh, that's right. To make the milk, they have to use their uh, apparatus or whatever the hell to stir the stomach of the female machines. Yeah. Oh my god. Now oh, she's just straight up gone. He's not important enough because I don't even get him in the log. Alright, well. I guess it's kind of a thing of should I. Should I grind for money or should I just go looking around and asking everyone about stuff? Let's see, what the hell did Noom say again? Noom said. But it's Hasa. Ooh. Ooh. Go to the Fukuju Apartments. You got it. I say let's just go until I need to get some upgrades. Although it, it does talk about some of the parts that I'll need to get upgrades. So I guess I'll worry about it then. Actually, you know what? The guy that's um, sitting in here. Let's see if he has anything to say. Oh, he's not here. Oh, huh. okay. Is he anyone in this one? There you are. It's to me, the me sleep, me awake. Alright, well. <laughs> All I did is move. Did you come to cool down? Sorry, it's occupied. Okay, so they use the fans to cool down, I guess. Sure. Makes sense. Maybe 
Maybe I need, I don't know, power or something to break through, whatever that is. Um, yeah. I'll sell a couple of crabs. Or whatever, or frogs, whatever. How much is this mock at? 65? Come on. Look at how weird that thing is. You should sell for more. Alright. Tons of stamps now. So sad. Check that trap. Oh, nothing. Perfect. This one has one. Hey. Didn't I have a medium bottle trap somewhere? I got one from like stamps or something. Let's see. In the old days, Talasan used to enjoy spending time with Doku. You know Doku. Doku had one body but was two. I wonder what they are doing now. I guess Tasan about Doku. Where are they? I don't. Yo, Mariwaki. I don't know who Ta is. Unless they're talking about Takashi, but I don't know. Okay, I need to remember which direction I'm in. Orientation. Oh, this has to do toy wars. Let's see what else this guy has to say. I don't really like the laboratory. These are interesting. Posters? I'll... Let's see, what, what do I gotta do? Oh, okay. Oh, I gotta find... Okay, so there's six bulletin boards. I just gotta find them all. I get test print. E. Fishing spots. Met all machines that come to the cooling rooms. Oh, so I should just keep visiting there. Um, cargo lift, visit room 8 of Seiru apartment, visit New World, visit Medici's room, visit Lau's room. Use Noom's lift. Okay, so Noom has a lift. Good to know. Search all places. Um, you know what? I don't remember. I do remember being in here, but just not a lot. Uh, let's go to the Milky Fuel Station first. Play. Nope, oh, that was also the wrong way. I can get myself killed. Okay. Go first. And some run a little low. Hey, what's up, buddy? Jesus, your mouth. Hey, let's go to um Ichigo again. Very much. Thank you. Okay. 
sent into these apartments. Uh, you know what? Wait, I'm going upstairs. Oh, do they only open at those times? Okay, maybe that's it. Oh, perfect. The laboratory? I'm not interested. I mean, like, my puzzles is filled with colors, aren't they? I'm gonna collect more. If I collect more, there'll be more and more. Oh okay, yeah, if you find your puzzles, bring them to me. I'll make it worth your while. Find your rare printed materials? Which one do you want to exchange? It just gives me, like, random shit. Fishhook. Uh, let's wait on this. Okay. I'll remember that. The laboratory is next to our working place, but we can't go in there, and I don't want to either. I've always worked on the instructions of other machines. Everyone tells us to work. But we don't mind working that way, since we are able to work when we are told to do so, because it feels good to be able to work. Feeling good is a good thing, but when there is no machine telling us to work, it's tough, because we can't feel good. I don't want to have a tough time. Okay, so I just have to wait for the timing to get to each of these rooms. What? Dark. I can't remember anything. I'm gonna get sucked in with a whoosh. Have hey, you give me one of your ego recovering liquid? Sure. Thank you. Now I can work tomorrow. What? Darking. Oh, okay. Well, um, I don't know what effects that had, but just missed this room. Guess that's something. Instead of waiting a full cycle, we'll just upstairs. What an annoying um, system to have to go into their apartments at specific times. Oh my god. <sighs> Alright, maybe I should just use floor by floor and just wait. It's gonna be annoying. Letter from Shen. Oh, perfect. Uh, or not? What was that? Also, I'm pretty sure I just missed the. Did I miss the time for all these rooms? Oh, here we go. I'm sorry, what are the items they send to us? I hear there's a machine called Mr. Koppel. I've never met him. They say he needs a certain piece of music in that place, but I don't know anything else. Once upon a time, there was an exceptionally large crab. Every day, this crab ate crabs that were smarter than itself, but one day, it suddenly became unable to eat. Do you know why? It was eaten by a frog. The moral of the story is, stamps are important. Laboratory, I couldn't care less. I only like things that are made by someone. You understand? Like meters, gauges, meters, gauges. I uh, you know there's all sorts. Don't I have to buy everything from this guy? Thick nails are dependable, aren't they? I guess from your Chibi shop. Uh, I've heard that there's a sewage lover in the laboratory too. He collects a lot of sewage and saves them. Your sewage is worth researching, since it's a source of everything, but only if there's value in researching, that is. You think there's value in researching? Yeah. Oh, you do. You should taste everything. Ah, it tastes of Reiko. Or there's this... Uh, that's right, tasting is much better than studying it. Okay. You're good. Ego is starting to suffer. I don't have a key. Alright, guess we'll just wait for that last room. Watch that last room be Tossan's room. So at this point, I'm just like, where is this son of a bitch? Alright, all the way to the back with you. Perfect. 
Ah, here you are. There's two Doku I know. <laughs> Doku and me <laughs> are a group of three buddies. <laughs> I <laughs> remember now the sheep song. <laughs> Score music box. E open. <laughs> oh, cool. Chapter 3. So I really can just, like, I guess go around and talk to everyone. <laughs> I like songs. I sing. <laughs> Doku sings. Cuckoo. This is our song. Well, shit. Now I maybe need to talk to everyone again. Just because... It could be something new. Wait. What was this way? Oh! This is it. This is the pathway I need, although my ego... Probably has to be filled. I don't like this. Sorting area. Okay, oh, hold on, hold on. I need to get some uh, ego and fuel uh, refilled before I do this. But yeah, maybe. I wonder how many chapters this game has. Hold on, let's let's find out. Give me a second. <laughs> of course, I won't find out because there's just so much, or there's so little, I guess, about this game. Let's see, so 2021 official remastered version of Garage Talk Garage Complete version was released. In the first time, the game would be officially playable in English, featuring UI and game balance improvements, new chapter side quests, and multiple different endings. Okay, so this is the the improved version, I guess. How many chapters does it have? Because I <laughs> I want to know that I'm not blasting through this, you know? Alright, whatever. I can't find it. And my ego's run out, so... And if it is a short game, though, it makes me feel like I need to... You know, spend some more time looking around. Should I go in the carousel again? There really seems to be no purpose other than, you know, it just being this silly little thing. I bet, wait, I bet the music has something to do with it. did here log Hassan Tassan Let's see the sheep song that's the one I need uh well since I'm at the ego shop let's see who else is in the cool rooms because I assume that changes every chapter some fuel. So, do you want to look at me? I don't know if I want to look at you, but when you come here, I can't help but look at you. Sometimes I don't know what to do, like, when I look at you. You have an eraser. Feels good to rub. You can rub out anything with it. Why don't you give me a eraser? You're mean. Everyone, even the lady next door has it. She stores it inside her stomach. Eraser. Store. think here I'm just gonna talk to the shopkeep hey will you do me a favor it's an easy task I want you to deliver this crab to the nicest girl at the milky fuel station you'll know which girl I'm talking about when you get there well she asked me to get it to her but I can't leave this place so easily so will you do it 
You know where the Milky Fuel Station is, don't you? Find it if you go around the other outer track. Alright, um... I don't know which one he wants to need to deliver it to, but... Sure, I need to get some fuel anyways. Let's see, facing you, clinic, so go right. Can I have for bullets and boards? I, I keep forgetting. Uh, what else? Catching mini frogs. I need to. There we go. Ooh, bunch of you go recovering liquid. Hey, bud. Okay, so I'm, I'm assuming her, I don't know, she seems the nicest to me. But hello. Goodbye, what? Uh, you're giving the scrap bar to me? Oh, thank you. Well, I guess the task is done. This is a billboard. Yeah, I already saw that billboard. Well, job well done then. Too bad I have to go to my room to save. So we're in the sorting area. That's something. Let's see. Yeah. Sorting area parts born in tank. Unwanted parts return. Sewage rare parts give next door. I get to choose. No rare things. I don't know what they are. Yeah. I only know rare or not. Okay, well, we're in the factory. Not exactly the laboratory, but something. Ah, this is the door then. I need the sheep score. Heavy cargo lift to the sorting area. Because this lift is for transferring heavy cargoes, it requires large power to activate and consumes a great amount of milky fuel. Make sure to check your motor limit before using it. Okay, so I need to... I think do a couple of upgrades. Hassan's gone. Oh, let's explore the rest of this area first. Probably start grinding for stuff. Can't quit it. What is that? Am I enjoying it? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I enjoy doing that. jump you'll make it <sighs> all right might go back to uh fishing maybe memo singing songs feels good this is a vibratory separator. Sort sewage by by fate. Sort sewage is left in tank to settle. Heavy objects sink. Light objects float. Large things remain on the net. Small things slip through the net. This is repeated over and over again. 
Sometimes mechanical parts are found. Tooth like ones, this like ones, stick like ones, plate like ones. Ones I don't know what it is for. Okay. They're sorting through the sewage. I can't control myself. I can't control my vicious self. My emotion gets ahead of myself and I'm dragged out by it. Me who has been dragged out is bare. Missing the memo. I'm working right now. Come to my room later. This is the water tower. Pumps up sewage water. Pumps up everything. All sorts of things are pumped up. Sometimes it makes a rumbling or rattling sound. Sometimes it's light. Sometimes it's heavy. Sometimes it's sticky. Sometimes it's smooth. I just watch it all day. I lower the pump's gear ratio when it's heavy. I raise the pump's gear ratio when it's light. Just keep watching it. Okay. So I guess that's where the... The Ahsan brothers work. Interesting that this game has multiple endings. Like, I wonder based off of what. You know, see, that's another thing. I. There's some games where. If you just blast through it and don't spend enough time doing side stuff, then that's what affects the ending. And I kind of hate that, sort of. Because it, it gives me a little bit of FOMO. Where I don't want to miss out on all the stuff that's going on. So let's see if this guy's in his room. I also don't know if they close the door on you. Oh yeah, he is. Songs are wonderful, don't you think? High grade, recovering. Let's see. Oh, I did have some. Oh no, I I got the regular covering. I'm sorry we don't have any musical score. Go ask the old guy at the letter print. Press parenting shop. Blech. He closed the shop. I think he's still somewhere around there. I think his name was Han. Bocadero. Alright, well, annoying apartments to go through. <sighs> Let's go uh, make some money. So that I can, I don't know, pay for more parts and upgrades and whatnot. Place? No. Hey, Takashi, you're back. Where'd you go, bud? Okay. Oh, and here's Toy Work, so might as well talk to him. Everyone used to have music box and music scores, but today no one sings or listens to songs. Listening and hearing is different, you know? I have nothing left now. Yes, until that day, until the day I made the music box, I felt something guiding me. Now I don't feel anything. It's much easier not to feel anything. Uh, I think I understand now. The reason why nobody needs toys anymore. Everyone used to have a music box and music scores, but today, no. Okay, never mind. Okay, so Takashi, I, I guess some of the robots just kind of disappear. Uh, let's use fish hook number two. We'll use these mighty claws. Here we go. I get a couple of rare, rare things or frogs. Yep. Even though I've done much 
much power. Hey, there we go. My Godot's good. I need the two-headed ones. That's the good, good stuff. I wonder why the two heads so rare. Okay. Um, let's see what See what what else do I have to talk about while this has been going on? Um went to a pretty cool uh little pottery like painting place recently. Um where basically you can choose like one of the little pottery things they have around there and you can you can paint it and then they'll fire it and um you can take it home. Um that was pretty fun, but uh man it took so much longer than I thought because I actually didn't finish it and I was there for like about I think about four hours four or five hours and I still didn't finish paying just this like tiny little thing which I picked up a it's like a goblet with a dragon around it and I was like oh this thing's cool as hell which they do say you can drink out of it you know once it's done it just can't be uh it just needs to be hand washed so maybe i'll use it as an actual cup but i feel like it'll be good as a decorative piece but it was a surprisingly fun little experience and one of the only things i was thinking i was just like damn man i was like why does stuff like this have to take so much time because I, I felt a little relaxing. I'm like, I would like to do this sort of thing more often. But... I don't know. Doing things hours at a time, I'm usually like, oh, I could be doing something else. I'm waiting on that lucky two-headed Godot. That's all I want and need. You know what? Uh, I'm also gonna say something maybe slightly controversial. I'm not a huge fan of uh, fishing mini games and uh, games. I e even though it doesn't usually take that much weighing. I don't want to really sit around fish. I want to. I want to go off and be doing something. I gotta be doing some sort of task. And just trying to wait randomly for, you know, a specific type of fish to pop up. Shit gets boring. Okay. So at least if I miss a fish, I won't lose the hook, right? I want to know about the um, development behind this game. <laughs> I want I because I doubt I'm gonna actually know of any metaphors or anything that's going on in this. But I want to know why why are there male female machines? Why they gotta eat frogs? <laughs> why do I have to stick my apparatus or whatever in them to stir their stomachs to make milk? To fuel me? What kind of crazy world is this? Or like most um, 90s games with really weird like character designs. I want to know like, hey, did you have a, you know, actual like model that you made when designing this so that would be 
super cool to see. Alright, once I get one two head, Kado, I think I'll be done and head out. Although, frankly, maybe we should go back to that other place where the robot actually said there were, like, mutant things around there. So I'm not getting much here, so. I'm gonna bounce. We need to get to, I think, the Mia Builders. Um, we'll drop by the fuel station. So crab, sure, why not? So anyway, I, I have a bunch of mighty claws, so here's like 55 of them. Oh, I get one stamp per thing? Maybe not. Um, here's some rusty frogs, I guess. Here's a few godos. Thanks for your business. Hey, Liz. Thanks for the milk, I appreciate it. Oh, you can just click on that to immediately be brought to the achievement. Cool. I actually wasn't aware of that. So, um, you know what, I got 3,000 stamps, let's, let's drop by the department store since I'm here. Maybe I can pay for a few things I need. I'm not really worried about upgrading my fuel uh, anymore. I think Ego will go up if I buy the parts. Okay, it says all that. Oh, it would be kind of nice to get a ball trap. Uh, fuck the fishing information for now. Forget all that. I want upgrades. Alright, so we need these two, I think, for the next upgrade. So I could buy that. Honestly, might as well. Thought about buying something else, but... What's the point in buying the later upgrades if I don't even get the early ones? That, give me that. Cool. Stage 2 parts, done. And, hopefully that'll be enough power to be able to get the um, other frogs. Don't you just love a game where all that comes out of my mouth is nonsense? Alright, I'm ready for some upgrades. Customize my body. Cool. Stage 2, engine power increased. Your ego level increased 20%. So now I need the bore-up kit, the reinforced frame, the oil cooler. So essentially I think I do... I could just work on getting all the parts and then afterwards probably just walk around and do whatever I want. So honestly, why why not? It's not like it's even taking that long. All I gotta do is get more do headed godos and then that's a it's a thousand um thousand stamps right there. Okay. Nice. Um, feels good, so we'll just refill ego. Wrong way.
I don't know what technically lowers the ego. Oh, I need to get to the outer track. I think that's what it is. Okay, so head uh, this way. Then head to crabs. Okay, yes, good. I'll try it back here. I'm on there. There we go. Hey, bud. Uh, recovery machine, please. I'm for the left one this time. Alright, we are... Set. Let's go this way. Up. Left. You got anything to say now, buddy? Nah, that's alright. Take your time. What about you? Hey, isn't that a mockery you have with you? If it's possible, would you give one to me? Sure. You're such a sweet boy, you can have this if you like. Nice. It's been a really long time since I had a mock root. I wish Noom would fish for me, but he seems to be busy. Only there's a cue that triggers him. Never mind, I'm just talking to myself. I'm talking more to myself every day, I'm getting tired of it. Maybe... hold on. Um, what if I... I pull up my machine... or music box right here? like that. How about this one? Did it do anything for you? Alright, he didn't care. Oh, I'm gonna use your, I guess, backyard or whatever to fish, so don't mind me. Hoping I can get some good, some good mutant shit. Let's use fish hook number two. We'll use the root mimic. See if I get some better stuff. Something says that it's too powerful, then. Then I guess we will focus on upgrading. Is it Momo? Dog Momo is uh, it's acting like she hears something or wants something. I don't even know if there's someone at the door or something. All right, if I get rare, um, other rare frogs, surely those would be worth a lot more, right? Missed it. What do you mean? Lost the hook. Number three hook, then. So I'm guessing I could use the fishing guides to figure out exactly what hook and ooh, a frog. You know, what baits with what hooks or whatever. But again, who cares? I, I just gotta get some money. I don't have, have money to spend on guides on how to make money, you know? It's always a scam, anyways. Okay, I hope mock roots are good money. Um, let's try using. I haven't used these eggheads. I've got so few of them, so I'm scared. Didn't catch anything. Hey, okay, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Huh, maybe not the place for it. How about the pot crab? Maybe 
do the fish hooks too low? Oh, I thought I had some higher ones. Okay, never mind. Uh, let's try the frog imitator. Which implying using this as bait, the frogs eating each other? A lot of mock roots. I wonder if that's why I need to be more powerful enough to get. I could check the price on these frogs easily. They make some fun sounds. You know what? That would be another fun thing. Um, I, I really like sound design stuff. Especially when people put in efforts to make their own sound effects for things. It, it makes that feel so much more, I don't know, lively in a way. Gonna say at least give me the indicator that there's a fish there or I pull up too early. I keep waiting for some sort of I don't know mutant mock root or a new frog. Uh maybe maybe Godot's is the way to go, you know, like high or like low value for the regular ones, but extremely high value for the rarer ones. That would make sense, right? You know, I was never much of a fisher growing up. Um, maybe partly just because never was super interested in going out and fishing. Ma'am? Hey, hey, what are you barking at, huh? I hey mean, I just need to go back to fishing hook. Um, I feel like I have just wanted to have one day where in the morning I go out fishing. Um, just, uh, just to catch whatever I can, have fun and be like, all right, sweet. <laughs> Done with that. Teal head. Me, you know what? Should I... I'm trying to think how much fishing I want to grind out. So if I really want to push it, I could say like find five two-headed Godots and then uh, then just sell everything that I've gotten up to that point. I'm willing to bet that would give me a lot of money. Problem is, I've only caught, what, like, three at this point or something? Maybe I'll go for three two headed Godots. Fishing for another. Eh, we'll, we'll say 10 minutes max or three two headed Godots, whichever happens first. Because at least in that time frame, I'll get a bunch of, get a bunch of, um, what are they called? Frogs. I keep forgetting the frogs, right? Get a bunch of frogs. Uh, you know, be able to buy everything, which I know one of the parts is 3,000. One of the parts might even be 5,000. There's three two-head Godots would take care of the 3,000. And we'll just see if I can upgrade again, then I'll uh, I'll wander around some more. See if I can't get to the next chapter. Of course, 
course, I'm gonna find out that the mock roots or whatever. I'm gonna find out those are worth like 50 or 100. I think they are, but. I'm gonna find out those are really expensive. I should have just kept going for that. But the Godot's got all these. They got all these mutations, man. And that shit was selling really well. I mean, hell, even even just the albinos, I think, are 200 stamps worth. So, I don't know. It, it seems good to me. That's that's literally 20 good doughs worth in of itself, and I think that's like the lower end of the Godot's mutant types. This game is literally just... You know what it is? It's an early form of, a uh, Dredge. <laughs> That's what it is. It's all is just fishing, trying to find mutant fish. And making some ad bucks out of it. Stamps in this case. But again, thank god I don't have to worry about fuel during this. Maybe I should. I wonder if there is. <laughs> I wonder if I should put on some like fishing music or something. Actually, you know what? Yeah, hold on. Probably. Probably won't be the most copyright free stuff, but uh, you know. We'll uh, we'll see what we got. Maxing music for fishing. Fishing music background. No copyright. Twenty twenty one. Sounds good to me. Seven minutes, come on. I, you know what, how about this? 17 minutes. Oh, hell yeah. Here we go. Now that's the fish and spirit. That's what I like to hear. See, doesn't that make the fishing so much more exciting? Damn it. <laughs> Maybe I should start experimenting with the hooks and baits. Okay, let's see. Let's go with hook number three. Um, we'll use a Godot as bait. How wild is that, huh? Oh, that gets something. Gets me a mock root. Now, is that because it's the fish hook number three, or...? Maybe I don't need to use the Godot. Let's use a Mighty Claw. I'm gonna get too lost in the fishing. Okay, that doesn't, so that doesn't catch anything. Interesting. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this will yield some good results. Shit. Okay, horned frogs, I guess. No clue if they're good or not. These frogs are best. Mock root. Not exactly exciting. I want to find something new. From the guides out there, there were a lot of different types of fish. There's a lot of different types of um, crabs. No, frogs. 
It's not- it's not even fishing, it's frogging. I'm frogging right now. Okay, so that doesn't catch anything. Um, what if I use a rusty frog? Okay, that's something. Gives me a mock root. So is it only entirely dependent on the hook? That sounds not right. Music that makes you want to settle down in the farm. Get some chickens, a cow. I guess I'll just, um, fish for a few more minutes, and then we'll go turn it in. Tell you what, let's... let's go back to Godot's. I still feel like I'll make way more money that way. Okay, or I'll grab some horned frogs, either way. Was I- was I just overly lucky? Was it just- was it just the capper luck that was hitting earlier? It's not- what do you mean you missed it? I'm getting it each time. Okay, don't- don't screw me out of these frogs, game. Cause yeah, I was hitting up a lot of mutant things. And now it just sort of seems like, eh, whatever. Alright, there's a couple more minutes of fishing. It won't be forever, but I will say, due to not having as much luck as I was hoping, I'll say at this point, I'll take I'll take one two-head Godot. But not having as much luck with the fishing this time it seems, uh probably gonna have to go fishing again just to you know get more stamps. You know, I was just thinking. So I get 200 stamps for refueling for Michio five times. Isn't it easier if I just do this at an early stage? And I just like literally spam the refuel because then I will make more money that way. Because if I get a bigger tank, you know, it went from 10 to 13 stamps. If I just did it at 10, I would have made like a lot of money. This costs 50, I get 200. Like, that's kind of easy profit, right? I also need to buy this little table thing. Yeah, I think, um, I think I'll try to do that. At, at least with one machine. And I'll see how that works. Okay, one, one more good old fishing song. Then we'll, we'll head out of here. Now that it's good though, we're biting. Uh, honestly, I'm just thankful this game uh, is real. Real nice with giving you bait. Actually, should I... I don't want to waste it, but should I throw some of the, the ground bait or whatever out, the ego fueling? Um, let's throw out one ground bait, see what happens. Or 
Or does that just make it to where it gets me crabs? Okay, it got me a... Got me a rusty frog. I don't know the points of that. <laughs> to see more people play these kinds of games. Uh, unfortunately, I think I, I would say for probably the average streamer, um, probably won't be able to focus enough, you know, to be able to figure out what the hell's happening. I'm not saying it I'm not saying it takes a lot of brain power, but just I, I feel like a lot of people would not care to do this without just looking up what the hell's going on and what to do. I know, I, I kind of enjoy the the point and click like Ooh, bad, bad name. It's good. I enjoy the point and click, uh look around, explore, figure out what the hell's happening. Except for those early games where you can actually die, or if it's like, oh, you know, if you didn't do this task, like, way at the beginning of the game or whatever, then that actually, you know, that's the one thing that actually sets it to where you get killed later on or something. And you just can't beat the game at that point, you know? It's like, what the fuck? It's like, what kind of stupid bullshit is that? Alright, I think we're... about done with fishing. Tell you what, next, uh, next miss. Next miss is when we'll call it. Even if it's one where it just, like, immediately makes me miss it. That one was actually more on me, because I I was yanking the thing around. So the next, next one. Takashi, how are you doing? You're just sitting there. Any advice to my fishing game? My frogging game, I guess? Well, they call it fishing, so... Alright. Well... Next miss. Do you think I can get a better pole or something? I would be able to upgrade the pole, but... It might just be the kind of game where there's not a whole lot of upgrades. It's more just about... Oh, you got... The thing you need to do this. Like the music box. Give me the music box. Alright, there we go. That's it. Enough of this. Okay. So we got a hopefully fat amount of fish. Frogs. Ugh, man. Not nearly as much as I would like, but... Whatever. Guess I can't force it. Okay. Uh, we need to go. For sure, frog guys around here somewhere. So, outer track. Let's go. Don't need any ego. 
There you are, buddy. All right, I got some stuff for you. What? Well, just don't see the point in selling those. All right, here's a few albinos. Here's a couple of teal heads. Ooh, I sell the two-head Godot. Uh, there's some rusty frogs. Yeah, these are 20 each. How about mock roots? Oh, they sell for 65? That's not bad. All right, and horn frogs sell for 80. We should have been pushing for that more. Damn, only 4,000? It's not... It's not amazing. Yeah, pretty... Pretty piss poor profit from earlier. Oh yeah, do I sell that... Lathe or whatever? I do so have the lathe chuck. Fuck, where's that guy? Oh, who needed the lathe chuck for something? Was that the Honda Bogey factory? I think it was. Right, let's go get us a Honda. Also the wrong way. Yeah, whatever. That's this milky fuel station. Okay, I need to talk to what's his face and be like, hey, I delivered that one thing. Hello. people were coming. I'll be right back. Here's Hajime. Okay, Hajime, do you have any info? Um, no one seems to know about the sheep song. It's fun watching you wandering around with smoke coming out from Honda's boiler ring in the air. It's not like I want to see something special, small changes are enough, don't you think? That's the reason I stay here. You really found one. Oh, Bocanero had it. Thank God. I'll tune up your bogey in return. Thanks for tuning my bogey. Bogey is upgraded type 1. Fuel efficiency. Oh, fuel efficiency. Hell yeah. I'd be able to upgrade if I had some bearings and spoke wheels, but right now I'm out of stock. If you find them, bring them to me. Bocanero invented the music box. He's a nice guy. Unlike Lao and Nine, they just use what Bocanero created. It all started from a sheet of musical score. 
I'm sure it never occurred to Volcanero that a small music box could create such ghastly power. Well, he probably doesn't know about it. You know, just like anything, balance is strong and creating a bogey. The frame can't be too strong. If the axle is too strong, it'll make you tired. Okay. Well, that was at least a little useful. Glad to have fuel efficiency. Although, again, the map isn't that big, so... I feel like you don't have to, but it's fine. My husband is happy as long as he can toy around with bogeys. He's always thinking about bogeys, and that irritates me sometimes. Here, take this. Spoke wheels? Oh, shit. I painted this from for a while ago, because all he talked about was bogeys. Well, I guess machines like him can't help it, but don't tell him that you got it from me. Racer. It has a strange sound to it. What about anything with it, huh? I wonder what it's used for. Did they have things that needed to rub out that badly? I wonder what a world with carousel and racer would be like. Carousel at the ego coin, plus that. Everyone does a sound that has a special significance to them, don't they? My favorite sound is the sound of this workshop. It makes me feel that this is where I belong. What's your favorite sound? Oh, you don't have to tell me. I was just curious. Okay. I got spoke wheel as well as I need. department store. Was I... Was I wrong be... Oh wait, I was fishing here. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's where most of the meeting stuff is. Oh, right. Let's, um... Let's... Just spam this. We'll, we'll talk with her. Hi, Reiko. Reiko again. I know it seems like I'm wasting it, but I should net me some sort of profit, I guess. <laughs> Just basically whoring myself out right now. That's what it feels like. Okay, I think one more time and then I'll get the next level for Reiko. Slurp, slurp. There we go. 200 stamps. See? Yeah, do it five more times. I get 500 stamps. Uh, you bet your ass. What is up, Reiko? I, I'm just basically gaming the system right now. Well, uh, well, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how much I can get out of all this. This is, this is pretty good and pretty easy to do. And I don't even have to give any, like, items or anything. It's just straight up make money. Hey, okay, one more. I think we'll do it. Okay, yeah, if I just, um, why don't I go ahead and get the level five for these three? Um, just to get the 200 stamps. And then the level 10 can come just naturally over time. Oh, even then, I don't think I'll have to fuel up that much, right? 
Cool. I'll go to Sean four times. And we'll leave this alone. Hey, Sean. Nothing to say, huh? This is going to be the most awkward fuel up I'm going to have. Okay, this is the last one. No, I think I need one more. Yeah, look at that. I'm at uh, 5,000 now. I'm going to be at what? 5,700? Oh, she said, please come again. Easy fucking money. I just use them. I use them to make money. Okay. Right. Now it's time to go to the department store. And then I'll have to head around, uh... Serio Apartments, just to see if anyone has anything. Oh, I didn't even notice this thing. What the hell is this? I don't have a key. Ooh, good amount. Teal root mimic, interesting. I was about to say, do I need Philip Ego, but I doubt it. Ego seemed to run out a lot quicker before. And maybe it's just because I've upgraded it. That's pretty good now. Alright, before we go to the junk shop, let's go to everyone else real quick. Wait, oh, this is your shitty base. Okay. So if I buy everything here, I get something. I don't think it's worth whatever I get. So a trace stand might not be bad. Told in your song about serious things. By Frogs of Suru. Where is it? Five. So if I do, if I buy all this shit, which is how much? Twenty thousand, twenty three, twenty three thousand five hundred. Then I get some bait. Yeah, I think we'll. I'll work on that another time. Okay, so he's got a bunch. Well, this stuff actually doesn't cost too much. Let's. I don't know if I'll buy that. Let's get the. What have I not seen? A unicorn. How about, how about just the Godot first? And we'll check out the unicorn. Alright, so. Here we go, fishing information. So, Godot, hook needs to be 0 to 2. Um, hot crab, my claws, root mimic. Hard stage, none. Fishing spot, entire area. The unicorn needs to be a number 3 to number 8 hook. The bait needs to be a horned frog. First, quiet places. Hard stage 2. Oh, and it needs ground bait, frog oil, round can. Damn, that's a lot. Okay, that's, that is kind of helpful, I guess. Anyways, let's see what we can get here. We can get the bore up kit, so this I don't need. Bore up kit, oil cooler. Oh, the reinforced crankshaft, I need that for. I assume one of the last upgrades. I actually don't know what I need, pretty sure it's this stuff, so. Exchange, exchange. Let's go get an upgrade.
Then I'll... I don't know. Figure out something else to do. I just like getting the upgrades, and I'm glad I got almost all of them in this stream. Probably be able to finish this game up in one or another stream. Ah, the reinforced frame. Damn. Wait, can I just talk to you? Don't know what that's about. Okie dokie. Shit. I want to see how much the reinforced frame costs. Let me in there. So how much do I need for the rest of this? Um, 6,200. Okay, so not, not the worst. Oh, and I can't even get the frame from here. No. Well, whenever I find that frame, I'll be able to be able to just pop in there and get upgrade. So great. Now I got money for no reason. Okay. I'm gonna load around the department store for a second because it's a little confusing. So this is to go to Crab. Oh, that's where the station is. Probably get a refill when I'm done here. Here. Crabman. Can't go past Crabman. Go for the bait. That's the fuel station. What's that? Oh, this is for the lift, right? Duh. Um, okay, well. I guess I'll... It's not a huge need to refill, but whatever part of progress for refilling for each of these ladies. If I go the right way. Okay, so go here. Refill here. Hi, Liz. What's up? You're welcome. I should have gotten the... Should have gotten the table for... from Yoshibe. Um, right, to the apartments. We'll also see if anyone new is in here, since I'm here. Right there. Oh, yeah, it has changed. Okay. Guess I just have to randomly come in here. I bet it's based off of this. I bet if I just keep checking, all of a sudden there's magically gonna be someone there. Okay. We're going to the right. Honestly, I guess this is my each way. Need to switch tracks here. Okay. Uh, let's um go through each of these. Okay, so you really like the posters. 
All I get from you is frog oils and fish hooks and... Well, actually, do you have any... Do you have any high recovering liquid? I'll take it. Nothing. Okay. Sorry I have any musical score. Let me talk to Han. So we're at the letterpress, letterpress printing shop. Hundred one for all, don't you think? I grade a little more liquid. Oh wait, there is a room back there. Pretty sure that's where Toss on his fuck. Well, I know I have to find the sheep song, but I think I just have to talk to everyone until I find out who has it. The why I watch such a thing, something has changed since then, nothing is certain in this world after all. I'm in sewage like this is the best. Ah, taste of Michio. What did you watch? I don't even remember. I don't know what I talked to you about. post a letter from Shin. Let me see. Or maybe it's just I can't send it. Since that's to me, technically. Um, bu -bu -bu, there's an old memo somewhere that I've missed. Time zone waiting for. Waiting for top of the block. Ah, perfect. See, score, do you mean that piece of paper you used to make sound, that worthless toy? Do you think I have any such thing? Don't confuse me with Toral up. In spawn time, there's a frog. I always say. You too, shall I? Oh, value your stamps. You ready for a buzz? There it is. Musical score, not a meter. Is lost his fucking mind. So, let's see, what does this thing do? Okay, I guess I took care of it because I activated it earlier, I swear. I wonder if I have to pay attention to this, but I think it's, it's just like that for everything. up with that door. This person open? I already talked to them, right? Yeah. Pretty sure I did. Hope I did. Oh, this hallway I totally missed before. Hey, there's the last memo. I am my slave. So what? It's natural that I am my slave. Old memo number seven? Fuck, man. Where's three? Rusty Frog, we exchange it for my five pot crabs. Sure, here. Oh, here's Takashi. Huh. Oh, I can buy frogs from him? Huh. I don't know why I would do that, but okay. I guess it makes it easy if I have a shitload of money and just don't want to worry about getting a specific crab. I can't believe I missed this pathway before. Yes, it's true that I used to make music scores, but that was a very long time ago. Do you know the place called The New World? Until that place was built, my job was to create scores and diaries, but since then my job gradually shifted to making posters and flyers for the new world. And about that time, the number of roots in this world began to decrease. It was probably because the amount of sewage decreased drastically. The roots became scarce who can't make paper, so I had no choice but to make posters using papers of diaries and scores. I don't know if the score you were looking for was used for making a poster, but it's a possibility. I forgot his name, but there's a machine who collects the posters I made. Why don't you try asking him? I think his eyes are always vibrating. Like this. Okay, so I gotta find... I gotta go talk to What's-His-Face. Oh, the 
This is a path we can now, Val. Can I fish here? Fuck yeah, I can. Where am I? Oh, okay. So there was a way to get here. Uh, um... Let's see, what, what was the... I want to try to get the unicorn fish. Frog all round can. Number three hook, horn frog. I don't have any frog oil, so never mind. Forget that. We're gonna get one fish and then we're gonna head out. Wow. Okay. Don't have whatever I need there. But now I know how to get there. So cool. Let's go talk to what's his face, see if he'll give up one of his posters. He seems to be asleep. Maybe I don't know what that did. Whatever. Still want to check with the other apartments. Ah, yes, roommate. I wish I had some uh, keys to go around and open everything. Poster guy, I think, is on the right. I think we're just in time. Never mind. So, wait for us to buzz in then. This music is enough to make you go insane, huh? Hey bud, um, post your opinion on the music score of the Sheep song. I don't have it, but I sure do want it. Posts are usually posted on the bulletin board, but I heard that because of renovation of buildings and the like, some posters got hidden behind walls. Me and the builder should know about these things, but he can't speak. Do you get it? Chapter 4, the hidden bulletin board. That's what I gotta find. Gotta go talk to Mia. All right, well, you know what? I'm happy with the progress today. I think we'll just head back to my room, save. We'll call it a stream. Call it a game. Ajime, you got anything to say? Goofy little guy. You know, Shen, he used to live in the room you're living now. I wonder where he went. He liked asking questions just like you. Such a weird hobby. Maybe machines like you are called active. Even though you guys are right in front of me, I feel like you're somewhere far away. But from your eyes, maybe we are the ones that look that way. I don't like far away places. I like places that are nearby. Why? So I, I guess Shin's the person that lived there before me and just questioned a lot of things. about this. I can't even fish behind my own house. Sad. Okay, let me try one thing with this. What's the... What's the pattern for opening that? Is it first two? One, no. Two. Okay, so it's just the last one I put out. I don't know. I was hoping if it was like every other one or something, then like maybe. Let me double check, um, Ben's memos. Might be able to find my shadow, shadow if I have Psyche. Mr. Bulkanero, please fix this. Are not allowed to open the floodgate? 
I'm gonna ask Lau where he is. If I can't find my shot, everything will be over. I have to live in my past forever. Okay, well, I guess that's good enough for now. Hold on, before I keep a record. Okay, yep, good enough for now. Uh, pretty good. Oh my god, we have talked to so many robots now. Got to get stamps for that. So you get reimbursed a couple of hundred stamps for paying thousand. I hope I won't have to um, do a lot of like farming or fishing, but probably will since it seems to be the only way to get money. But anyways, uh, yeah, thank you everybody that came by today. I appreciate you. Hope, uh, hope it was an interesting <laughs> experience to see Garage Bad Dream Adventure. Um, let's see, next stream I'm probably gonna do Wind Waker Randomizer again, and yeah. Um, hope everyone has a good rest of their day or night, and, uh, I'll see you later. <laughs>